How's it going, FPL managers, and welcome back to our FPL era YouTube video. If you're new to the channel, please like this video and subscribe for weekly FPL content. Double Game Week 26 has just come to a conclusion last night, and what a game week it turned out to be. However, there's a quick turnaround to Game Week 27 with the deadline at half six this evening. In this video, we'll be looking at how my team fared out in Game Week 26, and we'll also be looking at my transfer plans and team selection ahead of Game Week 27. Let's get into it. Double game week 26 ends with a score of 143 points. Where else to start but highlighting that triple captain Salah with his 84 point return. It was the absolute stuff of dreams with Salah scoring three times over the two games and also grabbing an assist. I have to know it was fairly lucky as his goal against Norwich should have been cleared by Hanley and his other two goals against Leeds were two penalties but I'm definitely not complaining. His 84 point return as a triple captain will make him go down in FPL history for one of their most memorable triple captain returns. A big shout out also to Trent, Robbo, Saka, Rafinha and Dennis who all returned over the double game week. With Salah's Hall as my triple captain and these other returns it resulted in me getting a green arrow and I've now gone for 48k up to 41k overall. With the game week 27 deadline at 6.30 this evening, let's move on and have a look at how I'm lining up ahead of this game week. If you watched my last video, you'll be seeing I'll be playing my free hit chip this week. I have two to play and with only eight players in my original team starting this week and two of them Watford strikers against Man United, I thought the best option was to play it this week. You can watch my previous video to see who I believe to be the foundations of a Game Week 27 free hit team. I also released this in thread form over on Twitter, and it received some amazing feedback from the FPL community over there. If you're on Twitter, why not head over there and give it a read, and if you like what you see, give us a follow for more weekly FPL threads. With that out of the way, let's move on and have a look at how my free hit team is potentially lining up ahead of this evening's deadline. In my previous video, I talked about which fixtures you should be targeting ahead of Game Week 27. From this, I've gone for three Burnley, three City, two Spurs, and two Southampton as the foundations of my team. With Livermento a slight rotation risk, I might have to try and find half a million to upgrade them to Walker Peters. For now, my lineup is as follows. Pope and goals, Cancelo, Livermento and me in defence, Son, Mares, Foden, James Ward-Prowse and Bruno in midfield and Kane and Veghorst up front. With the lineup out of the way, let's move on and have a look at who will be given the armband ahead of Game Week 27. With the double game week for Burnley, I'll be giving Veghorst the armband for this week. A Burnley defender is also a solid choice for the armband this week, but with Palace after scoring four against Watford and Leicester getting a result in the Europa, I wouldn't be that confident of them getting two clean sheets. Veghorst is still a massive differential also, as he's only 8.4% owned, but I'm predicting this to get a bit higher before the deadline. Burnley are in great form also, so predicting Veghorst to get at least two tacking returns over these two games. As mentioned earlier, I'll have to decide whether to keep Livermento or try and find 0.5 of a million extra to go for Kyle Walker-Peters. Don't forget to follow me at FPLera on Twitter and Instagram where I'll post my locked in team before the deadline. I'm also planning on live streaming at half five this evening before the deadline, so make sure you tune in and get involved and send in your questions. If you've made it to the end of this video, please drop it a like, throw a comment in the comments below, and if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. Best of luck for Gaming 27, and I'll see you in the next video.